I am full, but I'm not yet full with food. <laughs> so why is your stomach so big? <laughs> because this is a baby. <laughs> Hi guys. Hello guys. This is Player and AZ. So tonight we are doing a mukbang, 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 whatever. <laughs> um, updating y'all on um how far she is. For y'all that don't know, Hazy is um eight months pregnant right now. Yeah. So we're just gonna be eating and talking about the process and how she feels and how eight months is, you know? Yeah. Because it's the first time we've never experienced this. This is our first child. Um, yeah. So yeah, let's just let's just talk and eat. Let's just get to it. You ready? You ready? <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. That's it. Oh, all right. Before let me let me um let me tell you guys what we have here. So we we have, as you can see, it's McDonald's, right? Um, we got um chili cheese burger right here. We got a Big Mac, hot sauce, tomato, tomato sauce, sauce, mayonnaise, mayonnaise. chili cheese burger, Big Mac. Um, we got the chicken nuggets we got um the french fries she got her drink barbecue oh yeah yeah the deep yeah yeah the other she got a drink i got my drink so yeah we're good to go yeah so right. what are we starting with i'm starting with anything here you mean um in terms of the topic or yeah the topic like, how are you feeling actually start about right I'm now feeling good because <laughs> there's food in front of you <laughs> <laughs> I feel cool. So, what pains are you experiencing right now? Because I know during pregnancy, everybody experiences some kind of pains and stuff. Then, uh, mm. I know it was very, very worse in the beginning, like your first trimester. It was not that bad, though. Oh, yeah. It was not that bad. Cause Hell, was not really not bad. Her first trimester was not really bad because. She didn't vomit. Did you even vomit? You only started vomiting on the I second one, right? No, on the first one, but then it was not frequently. So she didn't vomit that much. So it was actually not bad. It was not bad. And then being picky maybe on food. Mm. On and cravings. Yeah. But um, I feel like your cravings started being more when time went by. In the beginning, you didn't have a lot of cravings. Now is when you have a lot of cravings. All the time when I go to the store, you want this and that. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Mm. yeah so the pains that i have now like it's chest pains mm -hmm. yeah chest pains i have chest pains mm -hmm. and also and I, the reason for the chest pain is because the baby is like tending so it's that stage where the baby is starting to tend so you might start um feeling much pressure on your on your chest so that's why I have chest pains. But I have, um, my doctor gave me some medication on that, like to mm. ease them, like if they are so strong. And also headaches, because yo, <laughs> headaches are so frequently, I frequently get headaches each yeah. and every now and then. And sometimes they are mild, some are strong. So yeah, he also helped me with that, like um, medic with medication too on that part. Yeah, but then, once I, I take pills or like maybe sleep or lay on the You know the aim of the video is to talk while you're eating, right? Not eat, talk, yeah. and eat. So it's like um, um, picking pills <laughs> and all. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm chowing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Yeah, so that's basically the pains that I'm experiencing. Mm -hmm. And um, that's the gender. Too. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm. <clears throat> oh, yeah. The gender is. um. A girl, so we're having a baby gun in a month's time. So next month, she'll be chowing this Big Macs. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding, babies can't eat. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> but yeah, so in a month's time, we'll be having our little gun. Come with you, 
Mm-hmm. Also, I'm like this in my repeat. I like to call. Charge her. Play with him. Sing. Make her sing. <laughs> so, what else is there? Um, besides paint, okay, what's, what's the nice thing that you're feeling then? Mm-hmm. What's the nice thing that you're feeling? I love it when my baby moves. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. How are the movements? Now, like, she kind of rolls. She kind of, like, um, she plays along like you know if i'm playing music sometimes i play music for the baby Mm -hmm. and then she start kicking like start moving showing (laughs) movement like i talk to the baby you know and she responds and she responds yeah she responds (laughs) every time Mm -hmm. when i talk to the baby she responds so i love that moment i enjoy that part like (coughs) and tell them how she always does that at night. She's active at night, this one. Very mm-hmm. active. Like, um, this is going to give us problem. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's going to be... A- she is so active at night. When, by the times where I'm, I'm going to be sleeping, she's awake. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, I just have to wait for the baby to, like, cool down with the kicks and the movement. Then I can be able to sleep properly. And sometimes, even if you're sleeping, she wakes up. Because sometimes I sleep late than you. Mm. So what happens is that um, when I go upstairs, she's already sleeping, man. Right? And when I get in bed, I cuddle her, right? I touch the stomach. All the time when I sleep, I reckon, cuddle the stomach. And I still hear the, the movements while she's asleep. I'm like, oh, this baby's still awake. <laughs> mm-hmm. So that's, that's something nice, though. I'm sure that she's fine. Because that's what babies are supposed to do. Yeah. Especially at this stage. Mm-hmm. And she wakes. She would wake me up in the morning. Most of the time, she wakes me up in the morning. Mm-hmm. But I know at night. That's when, yeah. <laughs> what happens at night? She's playing netball. It's <laughs> 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 busy mixing there. Mm-hmm. Oh. When I mix like us, <clears throat> we'll put it on the decks. When she's true. Because <laughs> her parents are musicians. Um, <laughs> we have a studio. We basically do something that's music related every... Almost every week. If you're not mixing or recording, if you're not recording or composing, like everything music related. So she'll grow up, she, she, she'll grow up in um, an environment of music, actually. Uh-huh. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's actually a good thing, though. It's what? It's a good thing. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Daddy's already there. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. These cheeseburgers are nice. Remember how we used to, we used to love cheeseburgers? Yeah, from but they are so hot. Like, no, you don't eat hot stuff anymore. Mm-hmm. Well, I love hot stuff. Yeah, I can feel that. Yeah, hot. I love hot stuff. And I guess that she used to love hot stuff also, right? Yeah. Until I fell pregnant. Mm-hmm. And then I had to to stop. <laughs> but I didn't really that hot, hot though. Yeah, not that hot, like oh. it's hot, like I can eat it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's normal hot. <laughs> but oh, it's mm. not something that I can eat frequently. Oh, I know why they're hot. I forgot. I chose chili cheese burgers, mm. not cheese burgers. Mm. Mm. It makes sense. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Oh, we used to love this, right? Eh? Mm. Yeah. I remember cheese every morning that like, would buy the thing the cheese bells. Every mm-hmm. morning. Mm-hmm. Mm. This should be a thing. We used to take we used to order takeaways all the time, guys. All the time. So right now is the baby awake or what? How are you feeling now? She is moving a bit. Your stomach is already big. You already full. I don't know why. I don't know why she's eating this one. The stomach is big. Just because the this is all food. Doesn't mean I'm full. Baby. This is all food. You already full. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just play. I am full, but I'm not yet full with food. <laughs> so why is the stomach so big? <laughs> because it's a baby. <laughs> <laughs> If you if you think you're a big Mac, yeah, I haven't had a big Mac in a long time, man. Eh? And we used I to love it also. 
Yeah. What's your name? Think about the Big Mac. It's kind of small. It's yeah, like it's so not. Small. It's not as big as the name says it is. <coughs> it's just normal. Yeah. Mhm. It's normal. Mm-hmm. So next month you're nine months. Mhm. Mhm. It's the final month. I can't wait. Like yo guys, I'm starting to feel tired. Oh yeah. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm she gets tired. I'm so weak. Like, hey. It's a process. It's a job. <laughs> <laughs> it's That's a job. true. She gets weak, Shum. It's a job. Like, working and thingy. Yeah, they kind of help. But I'll be tired afterwards. Like, after the exercise and everything. Mm. Mm. And you exercise every day. Mm. You, make you sure have that you to keep stretch every day. Yeah. You have to stretch your body. Mm-hmm. Even if you're not doing like a heavy exercise, but it's just stretching your body. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It so, helps. This is our first child. We've learned a lot. Okay. You always online checking. Um, I don't know. You're watching these videos. Why are they telling you in those videos? Wow, guys. First, <laughs> I was so scared about giving birth, but then. I I was watching um since like it's COVID and we cannot attend classes for baby taking care of the baby and whatnot. Mm-hmm. We just said I just said that I'm just gonna be using the phone since now everything is on the phone. <laughs> so mm-hmm. I go to YouTube and then I check about how the bad process is, like how mm-hmm. what happened. So you watch videos of um people, people giving, giving bad yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No, yeah. No no no, I'm scared. No, I'm ready. Like I'm ready. <laughs> I wanna push the baby out. Like, <laughs> like yeah, you learn a lot of things. Mm-hmm. Learn a lot of things. Like, like I watch both. Like, um, the bad one and the C-section process. There's also videos like that. Yeah. C-sections. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They do post like they do updates and then they post. Then yeah, they do C-sections and what, what not. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So yeah, basically like everything is just there on YouTube. So that's why you're always on your phone checking videos and stuff. She's always on your phone. And like educating myself, you have to educate yourself because like, so that when the doctor's like, now it's time for epidural, you have to be knowing. Oh, okay, this one is gonna be helping me to ease the pain or something like that. And then when your doctor says something, yeah, you have to educate yourself so that the doctor doesn't have to explain himself to you, like, you see. So yeah. Mm-hmm. No, that's a so, good thing. That's why I keep on um, educating myself, and now I think I'm enough. <laughs> like, so I'm you know ready. a lot now. I know a lot. I just want to give back. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Mm. I just want to get back, like... You can't run away from this thing, hey? Let me tell you about that day. <laughs> so this other night... Hazy... I think you were, she was in the bathroom, right? Then somewhere, somehow... Like a little bit of water... Was dripping. Right? Then she's like... Babe, uh, my water just broke. I'm like... There's no way. <laughs> then he's like, I'm serious. I think you went... You even went and took... Um, is it a pad or something? Yeah, a panty liner. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. A panty liner. Then she put it there to check if really, but I'm like, nah, it can't be. If your water broke, you're not going to be in the state that you went because she was still fine. All I know is that if um, you're about to give birth, you're supposed to be feeling pains. I don't know, yeah, but I, that's, that's what yeah, that's what I know that from night, yeah. watching a lot of <laughs> movies and videos and stuff. Mm. So she was just telling me that she... She thinks her water broke, but she's still like fine. I'm like, I'm looking at her, I'm like, ah, there's no way. Mm-hmm. And it was nearly even a lot of water. I'm like, I, it can't be the time. Mm-hmm. You're not scared. Mm-mm. It was not. Because of how you were reacting. See, <laughs> if you were, you were saying your water broke, but then you were like, feeling pains and stuff. And like, really, you're feeling pains. And they was going to be like, okay, you know what? It might be that it's true. But you were just... <laughs> But they say it takes time on others though, like the con- the contraction to come. 
Yeah, yeah, but when your water broke, we're supposed to say that this is water. It should be a lot of water. <laughs> You are scared about that. You are scared like <laughs> I was so scared like they <laughs> I was so scared with that I'm like I'm gonna put a pen to light and just in case. So you can see. And then I waited for like thirty minutes and then yeah, it was <laughs> not right and then I'm like okay. Mm-hmm. But we're still fine. <laughs> yeah, because it they, it's supposed to happen <clears throat> around the twenty first, right? The thing is, I was scared that what if it came early or what? Yeah, what if the baby is coming early? You see, because it's all up to the baby if the baby wants to come out or not. So, mm-hmm. but something was telling me now nah, it's not the time. Mm-hmm. Meaning, yeah, you will feel it when, yeah. I will it's know when you tell me that, yeah. Then I'll know. <laughs> so, yeah, no, it's the time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Um, so, what else are we living on? Actually, the one supposed to know because it's you. You're becoming a dead now. I feel fine. I feel very, very fine. I feel happy. I feel happy. great. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm getting fun. I'm also getting fun. <laughs> I'm going to be a first time father, so. It's a new experience. New step in life. So what? Uh, she's going to ride the wave. But I'm, I'm happy. Mm-hmm. Are you are you also educating yourself on that thing, like when I'm not around? Some things, yeah. Hence, I say that um, when your water broke, when you said your water broke, mm. we tell nah, it's not the time. <laughs> so yeah, some things, yeah, you're supposed to. Mhm. That's cool. Nice, nice. So, what else do you want to educate us, or do you want to tell us about you? Um, being mm-hmm. pregnant is a nice experience. Mm-hmm. It's wonderful. Although people say, um, I don't see it. I don't see how wonderful it is and whatnot, but it's wonderful. Mm-hmm. I remember they were like, ah, being pregnant is so nice. Thanks. It's so mm-hmm. wonderful. What was so I'm like, ah, oh, man. Mm-hmm. There's nothing nice about this. And by the time I was on my first trimester, so there it was going down <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. there it was going down yeah and i feel like i was more weak on on the first trimester ne? yeah you were because i feel like i was not eating and whatnot <laughs> it was just more of and i was so scared in a way that i was always searching for is it can I eat this? Can I drink this? Can I what what like oh, on yeah. Google? Mm-hmm. Like I was a Google freak on my first trimester, but then as time went by, I just said, you know what? I'm just gonna leave this thing, that this googling thing, <laughs> and just focus on myself because I won't be happy if I'm always trying to Google everything. About yeah, but it. but it helped. Yeah, that's the nice thing about it. It helped because you 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 get to learn information of. What type of food you're supposed to eat, what type of food you're not supposed to eat. Because now you know. So when we have a second born, definitely you won't need to Google what I was, things yeah. that much. You just know what's happening. Yeah, what, like the thing about Google, some are meat, some are not. So yeah. that's why I was asking the doctor, like, if this one is it safe or what and what. Like, most important things I was asking the doctor, like, if it's safe to consume this or not. Mm-hmm. Mm. So you just have to check with the doctor about everything. Like if you have doubts or anything, yeah, you just have to talk to your doctor. He's the one who knows if it's safe for you or not. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's nice. I don't know. What else am I missing? Mm, I think we covered everything. Mm. I think that's eight months. That's what we experience and what we're experiencing right now. And what you are experiencing, I should. Mm-hmm. Mm, yeah. And that's pretty much it. Mm-hmm. So you're getting full? I'm getting full. I'm full, full like. <laughs> <laughs> but the food is nice, though. It's very nice. Uh, so, still wanna add on something or must 
stop the video here because yeah, I would child this please too. um they're probably gonna ask about the baby name we're not yet sure oh yeah, yeah yeah still deciding on the name so yeah but I think we'll just tell them on maybe the next yeah video. I you guys um, on the yeah. next video the next video is gonna be nine months so oh the, the other one yeah but either way yeah born. either way we'll, we'll, yeah, we'll, we'll just talk about it somehow guys about okay. it yeah so yeah. <laughs> What else is there? I'm bored. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we covered everything. Yeah. Yeah. So we're closing the video. Mm-hmm. How yeah. was the food? The food was very delicious. We spoke about eight months. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that's about it. Um, yeah. So yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening to us. Um, yeah, we're just gonna keep updating you all about um, how far she is, the progress and stuff. So yeah, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. Thank you.